In 2017, the Habitat for Humanity Omaha volunteers served more than 61,000 hours building 40 homes for members of our community. Yeah, that's a lot of time they put in, but as we know, building houses, it doesn't come cheap. And in order to continue to provide these life-changing services, the Omaha Habitat Young Professionals are looking for your help. Welcome, Matt Cohn and Megan Thomas. Good to see you, Matt. Thank Thanks, you. Thanks, Thanks for having in. us. Yeah, good to see you. Excited to learn more about your organization this morning. What is the mission of Omaha Habitat Young Professionals? Um, our mission is to engage young professionals in the Omaha metro community. Um, we try to promote positive change in the community through our partnership with Habitat. Um, we do this through different fundraising events, build opportunities, volunteering opportunities, and then we try to make all of our events centralized around like, advocacy, talking about the mission of the Habitat. Yeah, and once you dive into some of these bills, there's a lot of time that goes into this, but some of the members of the Young Professionals Group, I mean, you volunteer in different ways. There's different mm -hmm. ways to, to give time, isn't there? Yeah, um, we do, like I said, we do build days four to six usually a year. Um, we do a lot of event organizing. We're a in, little involved with uh, Brouhaha, and then obviously we control uh, band build. Mm -hmm. um, and then we also have opportunities to get into uh, partners with families. Uh, we, our current president, Jessica, was actually a family partner last year. Mm -hmm. um, so there's a lot of different ways, any way you can get involved. Well, let's talk <coughs> about that band build, Megan. Mm -hmm. When is it, what is band build? It's this weekend, and I think the sun is gonna shine. That's yes, what Ryan it looks says. good, right? Ryan says it's gonna shine. <laughs> he says it's gonna shine, it'll he shine. <laughs> um, so it's Saturday, this Saturday, April 21st, doors are at eight o'clock. Um, our, our opening is, starts at nine, mm -hmm. and um, it's uh, $10, general admission, $25 for our VIP area. Um, we usually have a couple hundred folks come down to the slowdown, um, and so we want to sell out. It's a fundraiser that is hosted by our YP group. Well, the slowdown is really cool. I went there uh, mm -hmm. for an event in January. It's a nice intimate setting, mm -hmm. uh, really cool atmosphere. So let's talk about who exactly will be performing. Um, this year we have CJ Mills. Um, she's a local <laughs> artist here. She's played at Maha a few times. Um, she's great. She's a like almost like a soul bluesy folk like music. Uh, she's she's awesome. And then our headliner is Josh Hoyer in the Soul Colossal. He was on uh, The Voice. Um, he's great. He's also very soulful too. Um, maybe born in the wrong generation. He's very like yeah, Otis Redding like my style of music. Of, That's what I love. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we're, I'm really looking forward to it. Yeah, you got a great lineup. Uh, so th it is, like you said, it's a fundraiser. And uh, the group, what do you do with the funds that are raised from this? Um, this year, the funds are going towards our uh, area of Adams Park. Uh, I think it's going towards the hospitality house, I think. Correct. Um, mm -hmm. So yeah, it'll get funneled into that program. Builders North Place. Omaha, yeah. North Omaha neighborhood. Mm -hmm. We do a lot of neighborhood work in North Omaha. Um, and we do a big builder's blitz over the summer. So this is a particular house as part of that project. Mm -hmm. And so how does the Habitat Omaha home ownership process work? Sure, sure, I'll take that one. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, so there is, uh, unfortunately, a lot of folks don't know a, a real affordable housing crisis in our community. Um, to give it a little perspective, uh, a minimum wage earner has to work 61 hours a week just to afford a modest one bedroom rental mm -hmm. in Douglas County, and that's uh, true. Uh, the crisis is happening across our country, definitely in our community too. So we are really trying to give folks that opportunity for housing to realize that dream of home ownership. It's just out of reach for mm -hmm. a lot of folks. So the, the, the families that match best for our program, there's three components. The first one is a need. There has to be a need. There has to be some um, inadequacy, substandard housing. Um, there has to be a need in their current housing situation. All of our homeowners are first time homeowners. So these are all rental folks that are, that are um, uh, renting currently that are applicants to our program and also they have to have a need in terms of their income. We serve folks who are 30 to 60 percent of um, area median income. So for a family of four that looks like 25 to 50 thousand dollars a year, those are the folks that we're serving. The second component is an ability to pay. We definitely want to make sure we're setting people up for success mm -hmm. so they have to afford that mortgage, that affordable mortgage, um, and so they have to have a work history. These are hardworking mm -hmm. families that we're partnering with. And then the last component is um, a willingness to partner. Sweat equity, a lot of people know about sweat equity. Mm -hmm. These are folks that are coming out, building their own homes, dedicating hundreds of hours to the work site, financial literacy classes, all kinds of workshops. 
Um, so it's a heavy lift. Yeah, yes. I think there's a misconception that you just give these houses to people. No, Correct. they right. get put in sweat equity, they take over the mortgage. Uh, and Band Build helps fund a lot of the programs that you guys yeah. are associated with. And it's Saturday, and doors open at 8 o'clock. It's at the Slowdown right there in, uh, in Nodo, downtown <laughs> Omaha. Nodo. Hey, more, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> for more information, visit Habitat Omaha.org. Well, thanks, guys. Thanks. Thank, Thank you for having us. Good luck with the event us. this weekend. Absolutely. Thank you.